Hello, this is John Paul from InMotion Hosting, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create an email signature in Roundcube. As you can see, I've logged into my webmail dashboard here already. I'm going to select Roundcube so that we can get into the client. You'll get onto this main page here. Uh, what I'm going to do next is click this gear in the top right, which is for settings, which will bring up these additional settings here. Uh, in this case, I'm going to click on Identities, and then I'm going to click my email address that I want to add the signature to. Um, you'll see there's a signature section on the bottom here, which is where I'm going to type in my new signature. Um, you also have the option here to use HTML in the signature. If you click that, you'll see it gives you a little bit of a WYSIWYG, and you could add some um, formatting to the actual um, text. And this is really a uh, preference. It's up to you. And um, in my case, I'm just going to do plain text. And keep in mind that if you do an HTML signature, that some recipients uh, may not be able to see it displayed um, in HTML, depending on how their settings are. Um, but I'm just going to put a standard signature here. I'm just going to say this is my new signature. And then I'm going to click the Save button here on the bottom you'll see this successfully saved message and that's how you know it's been it's been completed um, if you get an error for example that says uh, the fields are not filled out completely um, make sure you have a display name here as you'll see if I delete this and save it yeah you'll get the form was not completely completely filled out message here so in that case you're gonna wanna put your display name in and that's the name that's gonna show up along with your email to kinda let the recipient know who it's from um, okay, everything back there. I'm going to save this uh, with my new signature. And then I'm going to go ahead and go back to mail and compose a mail so you can see the new signature on the bottom. And so what I hit was the mail button and then the compose button. And you'll see the new signatures now displayed on the bottom. And that's going to be on the bottom of every new email you compose now. Um, of course, you could always manually remove it if you wanted to just for you know specific emails. Uh, but yeah, it'll definitely be there on the bottom of every email and you should be good to go. Uh, thank you for joining us. Once again, I'm John Paul from InMotion Hosting, and this video is how to create a signature in your email in Roundcube. And thank you for joining us.